everyone, I'm Eco Faith, and today we're gonna be talking about some of the things that I learned in college, because I'm obviously the best person to be getting college advice from. So yeah, well, let's go. Take time for yourself and your well-being. It's draining, and one way or another, it's all gonna catch up to you. So at least for a couple hours every week, make sure to take time for yourself so you don't feel like you're dying all the time. Sleep as much as you study, study as much as you can, and party every other moment. Don't keep to yourself. <laughs> find somebody. Just find a group of people or just one person. Don't stay by yourself in your dorm or in your apartment or whatever studying and binge watching anime all the time by yourself. Find somebody to do that with. Find people to do stuff with. Otherwise you're just gonna go freaking crazy and it's not fun. Trust me. Just go out and have friends. <laughs> Don't try to grow up too fast. That's a really bad idea. Now this doesn't mean go off and be reckless, it doesn't mean just do whatever random stuff that you can because life's meaningless and we're all gonna die anyway. This basically means take your time and be young. Adult things are gonna come along eventually. Don't rush them because they suck. Once you're done with college, debt and taxes and taxes on your debt are a thing. Adulthood's gonna come eventually and you can be bitter and cold and sad then. Don't do it right now. Let your parents help you. You're gonna be an adult, you're gonna get to do that, and once you graduate, you're gonna be on your own. Let your parents help you. Until then, you're their kid. They've been stuck with you, and you've been stuck with them for the past 18, 19 years of both of your lives. And seeing you go off and live on your own is gonna terrify them as much as, and if not more, than it's terrifying you. Do something stupid. I'm not talking about alcohol poisoning or like getting arrested. Don't do that. I'm saying go out and see the world. Go do something that you normally wouldn't have done when you were in your good old youth days. Like, go out and explore the abandoned barn down the road. Go to the haunted railroad tracks on Halloween. Just do something like that. It's great. It's memories that you need. Find out who the heck you are. College is for experimenting, finding out who you are and who you want to be in life. Because I can tell you right now, I hated the person I was in high school, and I'm still not completely happy with who I am right now. But college actually did help me be like, yo, that person you were for the past four years was a really crappy person. Don't be them anymore. And really just, it helps you find happiness and find what makes you happy and overall just helps you be the ideal person that you've had in mind when you were a little kid. Like college is becoming the person that you'd be proud of if you were to meet 10 year old you. Stay organized, just just do it. Don't, don't throw it on the ground, just put it away. Just put it back in its case, put it somewhere where it's supposed to be, because finals are gonna come around and you're gonna be freaking out because everything's gonna be a mess. But if your room is clean, you'll feel kind of like this nice calm during the storm when you walk into your room and your desk is nice and clean when you've been in the library studying for the past 20 hours and crying silently. Find something new that you like, unless it's like drug abuse or something like that. Hope you guys like this video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Press that subscribe button, it's probably gonna be on that side, I think. Till next time, I'm Nico Faith, and you just spent a few minutes of your life watching a panda talk to a camera.